Hello. And welcome back to Taz Wells 12. You're on my YouTube channel, which is Taz Wells 12. I am the host of Tara Wells. Today's video is going to be a Primark haul. I know I haven't bought one of these to you for such a long time. I've just not gone shopping. There's been odd bits that I've seen in Primark that I've wanted and I normally make a list before I go and then try and find them. That doesn't always work. So I've kind of left it to a long, long time to do this, but that's what today's video is. But before I get into the video, I want to just say the nitty gritty stuff first is if you like the video, you like the content, you like the products that I show in this video, then all the advice, then please give it a massive thumbs up. And then I know that you like them. I know that you want to see them and hopefully I can bring more to you, but it depends what I see and what I want in Primark for these to be done, if that makes sense. But this is quite a big one, so it's good. Please comment down below if you like any of the products, what you've seen in Primark they like, what you like that I'm showing you. Just let me know, comment down below on anything you want to do in this video. I will 100% comment back to you and 100% like it every single time. If you are new here and this is your first, your sixth, your tenth, your 20th your 100th video that you're watching for me i would be absolutely great if you could come and subscribe to taz wells 12 you can do that by signing up to youtube for absolutely free and then subscribing to my taz wells 12 absolutely free you can do that by hitting the subscribe button on my main page and joining the love family becoming a part of my youtube journey which i absolutely love subscribers that have already subscribed thank you very very much it is more than helpful and more than welcome that i know that i'm bringing stuff to you that you like video is not sponsored in any way this is not a sponsored video it's just an advice video or showing you what's in that i picked up in primark it's literally just a shopping haul basically and there's no sponsored or anything Please check out my other social media. So there's one on Twitter, two on Instagram. There is Tazwell12, which is my main account. And then Tazwell12 Home, which is my home account. Check, like, follow, comment, whatever you like to do, please. That'd be absolutely great. But now we can finally get into the Primark haul. In this bag next to me i've got quite a few different products and i got some products in the sale as well so it was quite good because if you're going from summer to winter or winter to summer or autumn you kind of can find some really really good bargains in between that period depends if when you go if it's like literally as soon as the sales are started then you can find some absolutely like gems but sometimes you cannot and it's it's just luck of the draw really like any, any anything really but we got quite a few different products here so the first product i'm going to start with is this these cloths so these are from primark home they are one pound fifty there is five mica fiber cloths in here and 30 cm times 30 cm so they're quite good little cloths actually we bought some of these like yonks ago before we moved in this house i just bought them on the whim and we use them as our dish cloths and they work amazing i think i got them in a design like it was green design they did have a green design in this with like leaves but they were all sold out they've gone i tried to look around i thought i'll go for this like marble sort of thing so get one marble you get one light gray no you get two light gray one dark gray and then one white so i thought that kind of match in this house because we have got a lot of gray but i did want the green ones but unfortunately couldn't find them but these are so good if you like do you clean any kitchen and you just want to wipe the surface just put a bit, a bit of water on them Sephora or fabulosa great wipe it over perfect and you can also chuck these in your washing that's why we got them because they're not cloths that you just use and then they get horrible and then you chuck them no you can put them in your washing machine and they work to a try i'll get through this bit very very quickly because it's more my personal thing but i'm not going to obviously try it on because it's a little bit risky i actually got three of these multi-way bras so these are from secret possessions for wearing your own way multi-way bras these bras are generally like the best i bought two on the whim because i couldn't find the ones that i normally buy from primark 
they normally had like a little bit in the middle so i don't like a massive thick bit but they had a little bit in the middle but i don't know what's happened to them they had sets where you bought the bra and then you bought pants with them don't know what happened with them probably just went out no one was buying them they just didn't bother doing them again so i was like i need to find a bra primark always do really really good bras I bought one of these multi-way bras i think it was the black one i first brought i tried it and also why i brought it because on the back you can see here it does it in different ways as well so you can do a halt neck you can do a cross back i think that is yeah cross low back and then you can do a classic just normal and one strap i've used that really really good and strapless i haven't used the strapless before so this is like a good bra in my case because a lot of the clothes i have either a one shoulder i either need to do the halter neck or the cross back for razor tops or something like that and also a strapless in case you wanted to do that way as well but these are really great so i thought you know i'm gonna go and buy i have already a black and a white one but i wear them to death like i wear them all the time i need to sort out my bra drawer because there's just bras in there just don't use and might as well just go and these can replace i got a white i got a black and i got a nude one this time because a nude one i've got some like racer tops in this color and that would be perfect so these were all at the price of four pounds four pounds for like literally like the like a really really good bra the material is really comfy it's really really soft like the bit in the middle is quite big but it doesn't really matter it's just so comfortable they work so well with all the different bits on the back i kept one of these just so i know what i'm doing but these bras are just really really good and they're four pounds each and yeah you come in every single color i was really lit lucky to hit jackpot on these i've got a couple of them already i've got them in black i've got a couple in black I really wanted one in like a really like lemon pale yellow. I've seen it advertised, but just can't blink and find it. They get sold out so quick. We were talking to the lady when we were looking at them. She was like, in the summer, she said they just flew off the shelves. Like they, these are really, really good. They had on an end, they had black and they had white. And I was going to get a white one and it was three pound for one which is really good because i do really wear them i wear them for bed or if i want to wear them for the day they're really really comfortable they're like a like a sports bra so they're basically like this hit jackpot and i'll tell you why then i found these so they're like in a like a light gray which i sort of prefer more than white if that makes sense and these were these were like this murky like creamy gray this is what they are so you literally can wear them in the bed they've got strap um just all straps they've got like double lining in there they are really really good i can wear them out in the day if i want to just like with a baggy top on it they're really really good so like i said i get them in a small which is a 10 to 12 i just like that bit more room if that makes sense i think i could get into the smaller version which is the xs which would probably be an 8 to 10 and i probably could have got in that but i just like that bit of room but these were actually on a different stand than the other ones and these were three pound originally and i was so lucky oh they call them light gray and i was so lucky i found them for a pound each so my mum was like do you know what she was like this color is better than white just go and put the white one back and then i literally like picked three of these up because i've already got two black ones it's just like yeah i'm gonna get these while they're only a pound each i thought that is absolutely amazing i would just be aware that i don't know if they're actually gonna make new colors of these or they are getting rid of them you need to be a little bit careful because these are really really good like they are just handy for anything we need to be a little bit careful because finding these at a pound it normally means that they're discontinuing and they're going so but the black and the white wasn't they weren't there was loads of them and they were three pound eight but it's just this color so maybe it's the odd colors or i don't know but let's just watch out and see what happens because i really want to find the yellow one of this really do the primark i went to i was looking for period pants <laughs> i hate to say that but that's what i basically call these pants i don't wear these all the time i don't like them i just get them for 
period pants. These are Primark four pack short, 100% cotton, made using sustainable cotton, Primark cares, and they are literally three pounds. I got these in a medium, which is a black, a, t a 12 to 14. Yes, I did get the right side. Just have them a little bit bigger, because when you're on your period, bit more too much information you feel a little bit bloated you don't want a tight pair of pants on that's why i got them a little bit bigger because that is what they are for so i don't care about the end of the day so i pay three pounds for these these were the ones i wasn't really looking for i was looking for like the sort of shorter bit at the side like a little bit at the side but they didn't have any pants literally they were like the smaller size like excess i'm not gonna fit in them or they were like the other way, like too big. I just went for these because I couldn't be bothered. My mum was like, why don't you go somewhere else to buy them? And I was like, you know what? I don't want to buy any more. There's four in here for three pound. That's such a good deal. I just didn't want to go looking around. I just thought, I'll just get these, try these. They looked all right. I took one out of the packet and I thought, you know, like I said, they literally are just period pants and that's all I'm going to wear. This next item was another steal. It was in the bargain area and actually I've already worn this. Well, actually I didn't see it. My mum saw it and she was, I think she wanted it. I'm so gutted for her because she generally doesn't pick out very many clothes and she saw it and she was like, oh, this is really pretty, but they didn't obviously have it in her size. But then when I saw it, I was like, oh, actually I do kind of like that myself. It's kind of right up my street and it's normally something I would go for. I've actually wore this already out because I couldn't wait and it is this top. I love this because this just made me think of like autumn vibes um, and I just love the print on it. You had like these nice red roses with the yellow, you got bits of green in it and you got a nice pink. It would go really nice to this lipstick actually. And this was a bargain. So it's just got a rouge bit in the middle as you can see and then a petrol bit at the bottom. And then it's got really puffy out sleeve, like balloon sleeves. I love this and it's a v-neck I was just like I want that so I think this was originally like 10 pounds or something like that 10 or 9 pounds or maybe 13 pounds I haven't got my receipt and I put the label off because I'm an idiot it was down to seven pounds which I thought was really really nice I love little tops like this because they're just easy to put on with her jeans you could put this on with a skirt if you wanted to like leggings yeah that's just like it's just a versatile top it's really really nice so there is going to be a clipping of the clothes in this haul so yeah just look out for that next but this was still for seven pounds look at this top it's a beautiful beautiful top this is a size 10 i don't think it had any size 12 so i got a size 10 but i think it actually fits me it's a little bit tight here but there is like stretch in the back like the stretchy back so it's not too bad i think it's fitting my body quite well i think the sleeves i don't need them any big like there's so much elastic in their way sleeves the top is beautiful This next item, I actually took inspiration of someone on TikTok. She does like, literally, I can't remember her name, but she does like Primark hauls and they're like really quick and you can see the item really, really good. I knew we were going for our trip to Reading, um, Primark. We were going to Reading for the day. And I was like, so I looked at on her things and there was a couple of things I did really like. And actually the next one will be inspiration from her too. And there was another one I wanted on there, which is a, like a little jumper. It's like baby blue and it's got little clouds on it. It's the cutest thing. Could I find that? No. So I don't know how she found it. But this item I saw, that I'm going to show you in two minutes. It actually was in the sale too. Um, it didn't have it on the label I saw because there was only a few stocks left. The one, but I wanted a smaller one. So yeah, I was trying to find the, the, the right size and there was literally like two or three. So I found one in the end and I was like, right, I'm gonna try that, I really am. Like, I think this is definitely, definitely gone down in price, but 
we'll see when we get to the tails. The top I am talking about is this. So it looks a little bit boring from the front. So it just looks like this black rib high necked top with sleeves, just normal black sleeves. I wanted it black as well. And literally it is like a really tight material. It's really stretchy as well. And then it's just in this like bodysuit. Really, really nice. But looks a bit boring, don't you think? you're thinking why would I want that and why would I look for that well on the back it is Chrissy Crossy so you've got a Chrissy Crossy back which looks fantastic you'll see in the clip in a minute where I actually put it on that's really good that's basically the like vroom 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 with this top because it looked boring on the front but then the back back looks really good anyway i got this in a medium actually and it was 12 to 14 that was the smallest size i could find i probably needed the size down but i just generally couldn't find it and this was originally 13 pounds it just says black on the back but i got to the tail and this was only seven pounds the woman said just be very careful with this she said it's not the quality of the item she just said it's just the fitting of the item and i was like okay that's fair enough i'll just try it for seven pounds i can take it back to our nearest store which is basingstoke or winchester or something like that so i thought you know what don't worry about it. i'll just go and take it home and try it i've got the receipt this fits like a glove this fits like a glove to me so i'm really really happy i probably could still have done with the size down if that makes sense so it's just that little bit more tucked in but then sometimes you want a little bit bigger top because if you're going out for food or anything with especially a bodysuit it would just suck you in so i'm actually grateful for this you can see it all on the next clip of, of what it looked like this top looks a bit boring from the front like i explained but the tie is in the back so so pretty like from the back like all the design is in the back to be honest so so pretty and i actually think it's fitting like a glove for me and it just looks like a basic on the front but the tie is in the back and also if you wear it over like a black bra that I've got, it kind of matches in. But until I've moved my arm, you wouldn't have probably know that's my bra. So if you wear a black bra, quite a thick strap on the side, it works as well. The next top is inspiration again and i did actually have one of these tops exactly the same that i just got rid of but it was like in a red sort of color like a, a sort of ready orangey color and i was just like i'm not gonna wear that like it looks really nice but i'm just not gonna wear it like, i think i took i uh, give it to the charity shop i was just like let someone else have it i wore it and it's like literally it needs to go somewhere else because it's just not my color anymore i did really love the top because the top was so easy just to put on with like a pair of jeans leather leggings nice pair of trousers honestly it was just a, such a good top so she had one again on there but it was a different color and it was this charcoal gray bodysuit with a really really high neck and i saw these and i didn't think i was going to like it and i thought do you know what do i really need that but when you touch this it is like a ribbed material when you touch this it sort of feels like gym material it's really really weird it's softest thing it's so 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 nice bodysuit looks really great again you'll see in the clip i got this in a medium i probably could have gone for a small again but i just like i said i like that little bit more stretch in it so i got it in a medium which is 12 or 14 and it was six pounds it's not breaking the bank 
and they have cast it in a dark grey, too much like a charcoal. And I thought this would look really nice. Again, it looks really nice with this lipstick. Very, very nice, very easy just to put on. Again, very, very good, versatile top. I don't think you end up sweating in this. It is very, very good and you can see it, what it looks like in the clip now. I just styled this top with some mum high-waisted jeans that I actually got from Asda. They were such a bargain. Really, really good jeans and are my favourite ones at the moment. Just paired this up with that. But look at this bodysuit. It just fits on all the right areas. So this is the medium, by the way. Really, really nice. And let me just come forward. But it's like, yeah, I know you can see the outline of my bra. But I don't really care about that. It's not really a massive thing. Grey, the dark grey. And it's so soft too. So soft. Whenever I go in the Primarks, I look in the bargain sections. You've always got to look in the bargains and the clearance section because, what, two items already in this haul? I've found it from the clearance section or the like, bargain section. I found some more, actually. I probably didn't need this. And I probably, if I saw it, I wouldn't pay the full amount it was. But it was this and i absolutely loved it i love the colors i've used one of these before i went on holiday two or three years ago with my friend and i said to her we'll buy some of these because we went to i can't remember where we went now how bad is that but we went somewhere and we went not for a night out clubbing so we just wore our normal attire we didn't really dress up in that way but we put gems on our face and like done proper proper good makeup it was such good, like the photos were really, really nice. It was really like very out there. Loads of people were saying all oh, the gems on your face and stuff like that. You never know when you've ever got to go to a festival or there's a bit of a fancy dress coming up. You never know this when these things happen. So there was two things that sort of like took me into this. The fact that, that it was all like a rainbow sort of design. So you've got like pinks, purples, blues, greens yellows oranges and like a sparkly orange and a sparkly bit and then you have got these bits if you want to put underneath this is the ps rhinestone rainbow it was the face gems and it was originally three pounds and i would have never paid three pounds unless i had something come up like a fancy dress or i was going to a festival then yes i may have bought it then but that's why i bought it for just a pound because i thought put it in your box where your eyelashes and everything are because you never know when this stuff comes up that you need to use it these things stick on so easy so basically they're stuck all on the sticky stuff so once you've done your makeup you literally just peel it off place it onto your face and it's just the easiest thing and it looks really really good when you've done like your makeup you could do like a nice rainbow make makeup on your eye and then wear this it would look fantastic so i thought you know what i will buy this for a pound and it could be well used at some point because we are going into like from summer to winter now and it's really depressing and no one's been on holiday for yonks you could maybe or we could maybe go on holiday next year this is what could happen i looked in the clearance the bargain section and i found a couple of holiday pieces that may be helpful when we do go on holiday eventually because i know at the time that they will cost a bomb so you always get stuff in the winter so ready for the next year if that makes sense because this stuff does cost a lot of money i picked up about four about three different items here first one i'm gonna speak about is this and it doesn't look very much and you can't probably see it but you can see i only paid a pound for it it was originally two pound it might have been even more than that i can't really see original label but this is like from primark's like own range the protect i don't know what it's called There's labels on it it's called the hair and scalp sun spray so there's a protection of 50 on here high protection and basic water resistance as well 
I don't know if anyone has felt this before, but I have actually burnt my head on holiday on my scalp because you generally can't get like sun cream on your hair. Like I couldn't, like it would be greasy as hell and I'd have to wash it every single day. I do anyway when I'm on holiday because you obviously the time you've been in the pool, maybe the sea, um, sand, like sun lotion does go in your hair. Like it does, you do wash it a lot, but there's sometimes where you can get away with it, like with a bit of dry shampoo and sometimes you can get away with it but i thought this was great because if so many quid i thought this would be really great because i have actually burnt my scalp before and it freaking hurts it really does hurt neil bless him he hasn't got a lot of hair on top of his head that's just unfortunate but i thought this for a pound we could really really use this a really tiny bottle there is only 100 ml in there and i thought that's really good to just take on holiday and just use it up if you can or literally for a pound you cannot go wrong can you at the end of the day but i thought i'd get the essentials in now while they're really really cheap so this was another holiday piece that they had and it was so the label's like lying here i'll show you in a minute and then i picked this up this ps after sun face mask so it's 24 hour moisturization smooth and hydrates sun exposed skin dermic loyalty approved and fragrance free it's for sensitive skin there's 50 ml in here this was originally three pounds 50 where they're saying it's two when it wasn't so then it went down to two maybe and then it's gone down for a pound i picked this up and i thought you know what that is excellent again so it's an after sun face mask it's with hydrastic acid vitamin e aloe vera and shea butter so there's some good little vitamins in here i think it's like a moisturizer that's what i think it is but it's saying it's a mask so i'm not quite sure at the end of the day shake well before use generally apply generously after sun exposure keep out of eyes if product gets into eyes rinse out water and literally that's what it is so i can't wait to take this out oh and have a look at it i might do it now actually just open the box now and it's just like this tiny little tub which i think is moisturizer but i don't know yeah it's moisturizer which i think that's really really good again hydronic acid in it and hydronic acid for your skin is amazing and that's what is in most moisturizers and most products so i think for a pound that was excellent amount to get I am going to probably really like end up liking this and then probably wish I bought another one. That's the way it always goes. And then when you want to buy another one, they're like, that was £3.50 originally. Like, do you know what I mean? £3.50 to £1 is a good, massive deal. Like, after you have been out in the sun, then like on holiday, and then you come in, you've had a shower and your skin just feels like that dryness. You can just generally feel it on your skin. This is gonna really help. And it, if it goes with makeup, even better at the end of the day. So I'm really glad I picked that product up. The last final item or product that I picked up again was reduced. It was this. Again, a really good little pickup again. This is the PS Sun Protect Oil Spray. It's coconut, obviously that's what I've got the coconut sign. It's IPS, I protection on your face is 15. Medium protection, there's 150 ml in here. Apply generous 15 minutes prior to sun exposure. Reapply after every one to two hours and always, always after pursuing swimming sports and toweling rub it down well wait for the sun exposure so this is a good smell as well why i got this well actually i got two bottles of this i use this a lot on holiday so the first day when i get on holiday i will normally use a sun lotion just to get my body used to the exposure if i'm not absolutely burning by the, the time that i've either gone in the pool or i've just laying laying around like sun lounging i will then put this on because this will give you a massive good tan it is so good oil sprays are the best to get a tan i've noticed normally i go for the non-fragrance but these are only a bottle at a pound and they're only tiny bottles so really could take two bottles 
for the price of one and then you could just take one in your bag which is better if it's a little bottle I seem to tan really really better with this so i don't put it on my face i put like normal lotion on there because poor neil needs lotion because he's not skin is not used to the sun and it doesn't like the sun but my skin probably after the first day it's probably okay with the sun I have to be careful i don't burn myself with this because you can burn yourself really really easy but like it says apply more and then if you do feel like you're burning then i will then just put normal lotion on it depends like what what's going on with the weather and the sun and everything but if you want a really good tan then definitely get an oil spray i don't we'll always go for a coconut one because a coconut one can mislead to bugs flies wasps bees because it was only pound i thought you know what go for it i do love a, a scent of coconut but that's the only reason i normally don't go for it but for a pound this was a really good find again because these are really more, quite expensive for a normal bottle and i always try and find them on cheap unfortunately we have come to the end of the primer haul i hope that you like the products i give you or the advice or maybe that you've gone and had a look at the bargain section or the clearance section like i said there is some really good things in there i probably got out of there six items that were in the clearance and bargains i think you should always always go in there and always find your bargains because generally that's what primark is for giant primark is for is that general like really easy good quick fashion and when you get really good like bits like that it's worth just getting them because generally if you can find your size like i was looking at all the bikini tops and all the bikini bottoms but unfortunately i couldn't find any of my size otherwise i would have got some of them because they go down to like 50p like to a pound honestly that is ridiculous but they all had like bigger sizes all the colors i didn't want it depends when you go if you go at the peak time that they've done the sale and their clearances you can get some really good items so like i've got like i bought some black shorts like ages ago and then i went the year after and they did the same shorts but luckily i went at the right time and they had my size and all the size up i wanted in the sale and i grabbed another pair of them because i think they're fantastic and they're going to be another holiday essential like i said if you like the video and you like the advice i'll give you then please do give it a massive thumbs up because then i can bring more to you comment down below i will 100 comment back to you every single time and like your comment please subscribe to taz 12 i love more of you to join this channel and see what's coming up there's loads more different things there's home things there's shopping there's makeup there's hair there's literally like loads of car boot sales there's loads of different like videos i'm bringing out to you so yeah please come and join and you can do that by hitting the subscribe button on my main channel and joining the love family my youtube journey as we go along the video is not sponsored by any of the brands, any of Primark, any of that I've mentioned any more in there at all. It's not sponsored at all. It's an advice video for you guys and just showing you what's what I picked up in Primark. It's not really new, just what I picked up when I went in there. Please check out my other social medias, which is the one on Twitter, two on Instagram. Check out, follow, like, comment, whatever you like to do, please. That'd be absolutely great. I'd love your support and come on, on to that. This is the end of the video thank you for watching i hope that you did like the video and thank you for your support hope you have a lovely day or a lovely evening and take care guys and i'll see you soon bye